if you're looking for something fierce to watch this summer, Drag Race All Stars is back and contestants are putting their stilettos to the metal. Take a look. Who will slay it forward? I'm ready to earn it. Let's go. And win a coveted spot in the Drag Race Hall of Fame. Please help me welcome back Drag Race judge and style superstar Carson Kressley. Oh, hello, Angel. Hello, hello. <laughs> you all look so cute. Thank you. You look too. You. <laughs> you look handsome in your summer best. Linen. Thank you. Good call. You know, it's tis the season to wear the linen and the color. So mm -hmm. I'm I'm here for Love it. it. Love. Always looking good, my friend. All right, let's jump right in. We were just talking about this video. I don't know if you saw it. It's all over the Internet of a man busted for driving during a virtual court appearance. This is him driving, talking to the here. judge. He was actually being charged for driving with the suspended license. Now, I'm not accusing you of being a criminal, but has anything like this, a dumb criminal moment happened to you at all? Oh, um, I don't think so. Not, <laughs> not yet, but I'm sure it's in my future. Um, I'm, I'm usually driving when I have important meetings. I'm surprised I'm not driving during this interview right now, which is not, you shouldn't do that. So, um, but here I am ready to chat, but no driving. And uh, I'll be on the lookout and I'll try not to um, self snitch anytime soon. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me ask you, my friend, it's good to see you. What are your plans for Pride? Oh, well, uh, for me, Pride is every day. Um, I, tr I try to be fierce and fabulous and fun and all those Pride things every day and hopefully be a good role model out there. Um, for There I am being super gay. Um, <laughs> and there I am again. That was actually the very first Pride parade we did with the cast of Queer Eye for the Straight Guy. That's in 2003. It's my old nose and there's my new nose. Um, and here's the third one. Um, but I love pride. I think, you know, uh, being part of the LGBTQ community can be very challenging. And there's, you know, new laws every day making life a little bit more difficult, it seems. And having a day to just celebrate and be exactly who you are and be celebrated for it is wonderful so i try to do that every day but i love going to new york city pride i've lived there for about 30 years that was my first pride ever and it was just um so amazing to me being a little gay kid from allentown pennsylvania to see that much love and support and i think what's great about prides all over the country is that there are so many allies there mm. there are families there are kids there are uh, parents, PFLAG is a great organization. Everybody's out kind of supporting for that day. And we try to carry that positivity and energy with us throughout the rest of the year. Yeah, you know what's so interesting to me about Pride is uh, when I hear people talk about it, nobody needs a follow up explanation. It's just so ingrained mm -hmm. in the culture. Now, people are like, I'm going to Pride. And they're like, oh, when are you going? It's, 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 everybody already knows what it is. That's a big deal. Yeah, yeah. It's something, um, uh, I think everybody looks forward to all year long. Well, you were talking about families and fam Pride has become more family friendly. So tell us, are there any fashion rules when it comes to dressing up for Pride? Oh, I think <laughs> um, I think the only rule is make sure all the naughty bits are covered uh, <laughs> because it could be a family uh, parade. Uh, but it's also fun to I think it's also a day where there are no rules. Mm -hmm. I think it's about being expressive and um, just having a great day celebrating. Um, and whatever that means to you expressing yourself, that's what you should be wearing that day. Mm. I think it's, you know, anything goes. So well said. Some of my best memories in West Hollywood was at the Pride Parade, so I love it. Uh, besides Queens returning, because we're gonna switch gears here for a second chance mm -hmm. to be crowned, what makes Drag Race All-Stars a different experience for you and the viewers? Oh, uh, you know, I happen to love a Drag Race All-Stars because you get to see some of your favorites from prior seasons and they've been out, you know, they become world famous. They go out, they start working and they come back and they have the most amazing wardrobe and they've really fine tuned their craft. And um, you can see some of the queens right now from this season that's streaming now on Paramount. It's just um they evolve so much and it's so fun to see your favorites come back and really know how to slay the game because they've been through it one one time before 
and now they have uh they're they're not playing anymore as the kids <laughs> like to say <laughs> those kids okay all right i want to ask you this drag has really become as al was saying normalized in a way now it's even gone political how has drag changed for you since you've been on the show oh um i think that you know now the show has been on for 16 years it's our 16th season um on vh1 mtv viacom paramount plus and um i think the beginning seasons the early seasons you know it was the classic queens who had performed in clubs and had kind of gotten their training that way and now we have contestants on the show that learned how to do drag from watching drag wow. race uh, and i'm just like wait a minute how old am i um <laughs> but um they bring a different skill set and um you know there's so many ways to do drag and i think rupaul says it best there are so many crayons in the coloring box uh in the in the crayon box why wouldn't you you know allow everybody to have fun with drag so um there's lots of different ways to do it and um you're gonna see all kinds of queens on this last this latest season of rupaul's drag race all stars Ooh, on paramount plus can't wait carson so good to see you thank always, you for always, joining always. us dbl nation start your engines and tune into season nine of rupaul's drag race all stars on paramount plus thank you again carson happy pride thank good you. seeing you love. happy pride <laughs> <laughs>